This is Mark Wu from ePogramma.com. I'm going to teach you how can we um, make a slot machine in Visual Basic. So first of all, we are going to create a new project. Window form application. Um, we can make it a bit bigger. We want a button because we want a say spin or and okay this button is for speed another button is for end and the program okay so two simple step and then we want a uh, display a text display text box um we can change the size like this we can make another one by copy and paste control c control v control c control v so we have three text box Move it to here. That is going to display our number. Okay, and then we want one more text box in here. Display whether we are win or loss. Okay, so we have total four text box, two button. Okay night after stuff okay so uh, let's create our function for this text box the end function simply end that means end the program okay after we finish the first function we are going to we're on the second function so in here how can we create a random number so our ND, that is how we create a random number. But this random number is from 0 to 1. So if we want to uh, have a random number, it's from 0 to 10. What we need to do is multiply it by 10. And then we need to make sure it is an integer object. So we put INT in here. The INT function converts it to an integer object. And then we do a CSTR function to make this to be a string type output. Okay, so um, we need to make sure one thing is that like the text output, we need to know that the text box will take this number. So we do text box one dot equal to this okay we have four text box uh, three of them is to display an integer random number so we repeat this we change the name to two and three so it will display a random number in two and three but what are we going to do what we want to do we want the um, text box number four to display whether we win or lose. So how can we define? How can we define um, is this win or loss? We can, well, we can do this. If there is any one of those three text box display a seven, then we call it this game is win. Otherwise, it is loss. So we can set this to if statement. If text box one is equal to seven, or we can just copy and paste text box two is equal to seven, or 
text box. Number three is equal to seven. Then we will ask text box number four to display win. Okay. Oh, text box number four dot text. Else, Te text box four dot text is an empty string. Okay, so very simple. Now we want it. It is way this form in here. We spin it. Seven five five. I have a win. Two three seven. I have a win. Zero seven eight. I have a win. Seven o oh, four. I have a win. Eight seven three. I have a win. Nine eight zero. I don't have a win in here. So you see that now we want to close this program. How can we close it? S N. So it is that simple.